Hi guys, it's Natalie. Welcome to my channel. Oh, how's everyone doing? I hope well. Oh my gosh, I'm like saying the same thing every time. Is it the, oh, it's the end of the week. Ooh, Friday, hey. Look at my nails. Garrett did them. Hey, Garrett. I absolutely cannot wait. I think Tuesday, we're looking at Tuesday that the video I've been talking about will be coming out. Um, and we're probably going to be doing them um, like every two to three weeks. Let us know what you think of it when you see it. I'm just so, so excited for you guys to see it. Um, I keep talking about it. So anyway, anyway, let's just jump right in to why we are here. I keep like snapping my finger and it hurts. I'm like, why does it hurt? So why are we here? This is probably the most excited I have been to review a product in so, 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 so long, maybe ever. I'm not even kidding. I'm more excited than I get for Jeffree Star right now. Ta -da! Look what we got. We got two Norvina palettes. So you know what that means. One's going to you guys next month. So be on the lookout for that giveaway to start. Who knows, I might even start it early. I'm just like, I don't know what's going on with me. I'm just in a good mood. We are gonna be reviewing the Nervina palette today and I also picked up, I wanted to get them all, but I'm like, Natalie, you are so sick, stop. One of the new glosses. And then I didn't realize they had that new purple um, lipstick. I would have gotten that. I did not know until after I already placed my order. Um, so I picked up the palette and I picked up a gloss and I was like, we could do a little look with it. These glosses are so, so gorgeous. This might be the prettiest gloss I have ever seen. I mean, I haven't tried it on yet, but from just looking at it in the package, I think I'm really gonna like it. So I ordered directly from the site the day these products launched. Um, let's see here. The glosses are $16. And I believe they launched five of them, and I got Venus. So let's just take a little peeky peek at it and do a swatch. I'm gonna, ugh, I'm gonna do my look with it, but how unbelievably gorgeous is this? I feel like my nails and shirt like match this palette, like Norvina's vibe. I love her vibe. She is such a weirdo. And when I say that, that is the utmost compliment I could give somebody, is when I'm like, you are a freaking weirdo. Like, in my world, that's as good as it gets. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I am obsessed with this. Woo! Oh my god, yes. Yes, yes, yes! I'm way too happy right now. Oh, it smells good too. Oh, okay. The palette. $45. We get one, two, three, 14 shades. $42. Not bad. Not bad. It is the packaging how all of the palettes pretty much come. They all have that standard look. I really like that. Anastasia keeps things fun, but like sleek and classic all at the same time like their look is actually like their look but with this palette like with Norvina's spin on it is actually like my absolute favorite style like if I had a product line it would be a mix between like Jeffree Star and like Norvina like that is just that's the ultimate to me so it says Norvina on the front, Anastasia Beverly Hills, has a little pull tab, and then it's all, ooh, soft and velvety. Oh. And we pull it open, pull it wide open. Or not, what am I doing here, really? Oh, okay, so I gotta take my plastic cover off. And then it has a nice mirror, little pull tab to get this off. Guys, listen, this is my first Anastasia palette. Is that, how crazy is that? Like eyeshadow palette. I have their eyeshadow like singles, but this is my first palette by them. So I'm super, is it? 
yeah it is i'm super excited oh so that's to get like the brush out you know what i kind of want to give this this a little go this end this end i mean yeah to shade like i could use both of these we'll see we'll see how it goes so here's the palette the the shades how absolutely stunning how absolutely stunning are these oh my gosh do you want arm swatches people i know you want arm swatches so first we're gonna do dreamer which is a shimmer shade oh it's very velvety filling I have my self tanner on. Oh, it is so pretty. <gasps> oh, I love, love it. Then next is Summer, which is, that was like a champagne, like pinky shimmer. This is like a gold shimmer. Summer. Oh that is pretty but it's not like a true gold it's like a I want to say it's like a rose gold and a gold mixed that's what I see with that next is wild child which I am dying for this one dying for it could not wait to try this oh yeah yep let's get a little more on there so you could see it look at that mm-hmm then we have rose gold next and I love how there's a lot of shimmers in here like half shimmers half mattes because this is rose gold to me when people are like I want more mattes like I do I understand that but honestly I want just as many shimmers like to me I you know the kind of looks I like I want fun like I want fun celestial I'm so excited to see how these purples are I have a feeling they're going to perform well. I just know that she put out a good product. I know it. By how, how serious she has taken this, I knew I was going to love this. Then we have Dazzling. Gorgeous. They're all like, I, oh my god. And then Drama which is a deeper, oh, a deep plum purple, but like almost so deep, so deep that it's almost like black, but it's not. Look at these. They are so, so gorgeous. So next we're gonna do the mattes. Um, ooh. Maybe I'll do them right here, okay? So this is just a base, and it's called base. But I'll show it to you. Um, oh wow, that base is like, that's my base, all right. You can't even see it. Then next to Soul, this is probably the color like so many people want to see and how it swatches. Oh, holy crap. I'm so excited to see how that performs on the eyes. Next is incense. Holy crap, these are pigmented. Then we have love, which is this baby pink. God, her palette is so gorgeous. Oh my god, I can't with these colors. I'm obsessed. Volatile. I'm literally barely touching my arm. It's crazy. Eccentric. Like, I'm not even trying over here. And you see, impassion. <gasps> oh, this one is so, so pretty. <gasps> Look at these. Like, I didn't even try and I got that pigment. Look at these. Okay. So, you know I'm going to jump into a look right now. I cannot wait to get started with this. Cannot. So I put my Pilo, Piloise base down 
and guys we're just gonna kind of go in like you know how I am just we're just gonna wing it we're just gonna start a look and we're gonna see where it where it takes us don't mind my extensions I'll put my hair down and be like whoa, whoa, at the end so I'm gonna take my broken ass fluffy morphe brush and I'm gonna start out with love no no I'm gonna start out with base okay and I'm just gonna kind of pat that down just to take a little bit of the uh, intensity of the white base away okay there we go I wish I would have bought a new eyeshadow I really need an eyeshadow to go with this look oh well and then we're gonna dive into love next okay just oh these are so so pigmented so watch out just gonna get some of this on the brush and just go in oh you have to be kidding me gorgeous this is crazy how pigmented oh I'm in love with these colors like just a super awesome color combo that's not your everyday average Joe palette. I'm gonna go in with this brown. So that is incense. Same brush and see that's something else I do. I keep, I go in a lot with like the same brush over and over. I don't know if other people would disagree, but that's how that's how I do mine. And now I'm gonna take another clean brush and go back in with Love. Like the same type of brush pretty much. And kind of just blend these two into each other. Take that brown brush again, and now I'm going to go in with Volatile. And just darken that crease up. Okay, so we have this, and now we're going to cut the crease. You know me. You already knew I was going to do a cut crease, right? So I'm going to grab my P. Louise base. Okay, I'm going to go in with Wild Child, which is the pink one, first in the innermost corner. Okay, so we got the pink down, and then should I go into the purple or the rose gold? Let's do the purple, screw it. I should have added. Oh, it's so pretty, oh my goodness. Oh, and then I'm gonna take this little brush and I'm gonna dip into Soul, which is the purple. And uh, oh yeah, oh yeah. This is what I wanted. Add a little bit out here. Oh, what do you guys think? I love it. Oh my gosh. So then I'm gonna need another brush oh it's clean and I'm gonna take the wild child again and blend it in to the purple and these are like so the colors I use huh 
Okay, I'm gonna get to work on the rest of my face. And it's crazy, I feel like, how many different, like, types of looks you could get out of this palette. Like, you're thinking, like, purple vibes when you look at it. But you could do, like, oh my gosh, so many different looks that just don't even, like, when you would see it, you wouldn't even associate it with this color palette. And I like that, like, when you have so much versatility. Ooh. All right. Let me do my face. Okay, guys. So, we're almost done. I finished my under eyes. I actually went in with Drama right along the lash line. And then I blended it out with Soul. And I used this part of the brush. And I actually really liked how it worked out. So, I... I give this a okay okay for a, for a brush that comes in a palette. So everything is done except for the lips. So I'm gonna take a little bit of my Farsali, put it on my lips. This works wonders, especially under a mat. We all know our lips get so dry and uh, I love applying this. Um, underneath my lip products okay and I have my Mykonos lashes on the Sephora um Lily ones these are very uncomfortable they're not nice lashes but I don't mind how they look and especially with this look I thought they would fit well it just seems like the kind of lashes that would go with um a Nervina look so we are going to use the Venus gloss from the Norvina set and it is so gorgeous. It smells amazing. Oh, it's so pretty. <gasps> this would be so gorgeous over top of a color also, but I thought for the summer look and with the intense eye that this would be so pretty by itself and I know we wanted to see it by itself so this is it by itself I'm trying to think is there something hold up what about like, this color Okay, let's see what it looks like, like, okay, so let's put this on my hand, and this doesn't come off, so I'm dedicated putting this on my hand, and let's let it dry for a second, and then we're going to try this. Okay, so, oh yeah, look at how pretty. <gasps> That would be so pretty but you know what I'm gonna leave it as is and I can do that for another look but um yeah so I really like this palette I'm really excited to dive in and try some other looks I just wanted to do a general look with some of the colors that I feel like are the staples of the palette um, let me know what you guys think of it if you ordered the palette if you like the palette What's your take on it? I feel like this is a palette that a lot of people have been excited about and probably are purchasing. Um, if it's one of those products that I feel like when it comes out, it's like, okay, this is one of the ones we're saving our money for. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, and I'm super excited to give it away next month, but head over to my Instagram. You know the drill. Check out the giveaway I have going on right now. Let's make it a good one. Let's put in some effort, woo! So that way I keep doing giveaways for you guys. And then, you know the drill? Oh, I just said that already. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and let me know your thoughts down below. And I will see you guys pretty much every day this week because I ordered so much stuff and I have so many things to go over. So, I'll see ya a million more times. Love you guys.